I love stealing Big Sissy's makeup. It's so much fun. Brianna, you did something wrong. You stole your Big Sister's makeup. Now you must make things right. You must right your wrong before the timer runs out or else you die. Live or die, the choice is up to you. Big Sissy! Big Sissy, Big Sissy! What's wrong? I'm sorry I stole your lipstick and I put it all over my face. It was a mistake and I really hope you forgive me. <laughs> I can't believe you took my lipstick again. What's wrong with you? You're such a little brat. Wait, don't worry about it, okay? I forgive you. I love you. I love you, sissy. Mommy, when's dinner ready? I cheated! I cheated on you! I'm so sorry! I didn't mean to! What? Ah, daddy! Cover your eyes! <laughs> this is all your guys' fault! You kids are so bad, you wouldn't have found another woman! Or maybe you're just a terrible wife! Don't you? Guys, stop fighting! I just got a timer over my head. So did I. Brianna, did you take my blush? Wait, before you speak, I want you to know how important it is for you to never lie. Because when you lie, you'll forget all memory of the person you lied to. Okay. I took it. I'll be back, sweetie. I'm just going to get some milk. Okay, daddy. But, little girl, what are you doing in my house? Go back to your own house. You don't remember me? Daddy lied. Okay. I'll go back to my own house. Uh, uh, Alright, Mom, I'm heading to school. Listen, just hurry up and send the child support. I need it. Who are you talking to? Your father. Father? But I don't have a dad. I've never had a dad. Fine. Don't tell me then. Class, I'd like you to meet our new principal, Principal Stevens. Brianna, it's so nice to finally meet you. No, wait! Mother, may I ask for a truce? You... May try. <laughs> I don't want a truce. You don't deserve it. Steph was my best friend and now she's gone. Look, I know what I did was wrong. But you don't have to be like me. You're better than that. You're right. I am better than that. But don't think we're friends anymore. You're dead to me. Yeah, school's out. Mother, may I go home? School's over. No, you may not. You may stay at school. Why is mother doing this? She's not letting anyone go home today. I'm hungry. I want dinner. I'm starving. Mother, may I eat my bagel? You may, but anyone has a chance to steal your meal. Brianna, stop! Mother, may I eat this bagel and only I can eat this bagel? Hmm. Mother, may I stop playing mother, may I? <laughs> you may. I'm free. I'm free! Thank you, Mother! Mother, may I stop playing Mother, may I? No, you may not. You may play Mother, may I for all eternity. No, but that's not fair! Too tired. I'm just gonna take a nap and go home to my family. Emma! It's not fair. Mother let you stop playing Mother, may I and not me. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna end you. Emma! <laughs> Emma, Emma, you forgot to ask. Mother, may I? I gotta get out of here. There's gonna be a target on my back if people find out I beat the game. The door's locked! Who's there? Who are you? Show yourself! Mother's here. Mommy, I got an owie. You can't cry. Hurry, blink your eyes. Plug your nose. Whenever you feel like you're going to cry, use these tricks I taught you. Crying is illegal, so if you cry, you'll be executed. Got it? Got it. Emily, are you ready for school yet? We're going to be late. Ready? Whoops. Owie, that really hurt. Emily, you can't cry. Oh. Emily, blink your eyes a bunch of times. <laughs> blink your nose. You can't cry. They'll kill you. Are you crying? I'm not crying. I'm not crying. Show me your eyes. Bestie, are you okay? You look so sad today. My boyfriend broke up with me. I loved him. You need to suck it up. I can't lose you too. Mommy, when is daddy coming back with the milk? It's been two years. Stop crying. <laughs> I said stop. You're making it rain. You're six now, so it's time you know. You were born with a curse. Whenever you cry, it rains. You can't tell anyone about this because they might judge you for your curse. I can't believe Derek broke up with me. 
Oh, Brianna, it's going to be okay. Come on, let's get you home. It's raining. Let's wait till it stops. No, no, it's okay. It will stop raining now. The rain actually stopped. How did you know it would stop raining? I have to tell you something. I was born with a curse. Whenever I cry, it rains. But you can't tell anyone about this, okay? They might judge me for it. Cry, baby. Why would you do that? Come on, cry. I want to see it rain. How do you know that? I'm sorry. I told them. <gasps> that must be my soulmate. Did you send your address to Mr. James? You made a big mistake. Your address is permanently on Mr. James' face. He will have to wear a mask from now on. I'm really sorry. I wasn't thinking. I just really wanted to meet my soulmate. If you try and contact him again, you'll pay. Yes, sir. Brianna, you got another mark on your face from your soulmate. Oh, it's Hard Eyes. Did you meet him? No, some big scary guy came to my house saying, If you try to contact Mr. James, you'll pay. The Mr. James? Who? No one's ever seen Mr. James before, but allegedly he's the son of one of the most dangerous mafia bosses in the world. Brianna, look at your face. He must need help. What should I do? Nothing. It's dangerous. Come with me. So beautiful. Just as I expected. I mean, you too. You're, you're handsome, I mean, not beautiful. Well, you are beautiful, but... <laughs> I get what you mean. Well, you better get home and rest. Our wedding's tomorrow. Yeah, you're right. I now pronounce you Prince and Prince. Wait, she's a liar. Emily? Who's that? That's Emily. She's my best friend. Her mark is fake. She's not the real princess. I am. But Emily, your mark was gold. I covered it because I was scared of being royalty. But I can't sit back and watch you lie any longer. Is, is this true? I... Both of you are coming with me till we figure this out. No. Wait. The leader for today. Everyone, they're choosing the leader for today. I hope it's me. <laughs> it's me. That means you all have to follow what I do or you die. Timmy, you'll be a good leader, right? You won't make anyone do anything terrible? <laughs> Begin your exam. Oh, I don't want to write my exam. Everyone, take your exam paper, crumple it up, and throw it in the garbage. But no, no, I need straight A's. I have to write this exam. Eugene, you have to follow whatever the leader does or you'll die. No, I have to get into Harvard. I have to write... Everyone stop. We're doing 100 jumping jacks. Timmy, why? One. Two. One hundred. Timmy, that was a lot of jumping jacks. Maybe we should all drink water. No, there's no time for that. We're going to rob a bank. They're changing the leader. Everyone, we're going to cut off a chunk of our hair. What? No, I love my hair. You must do as the leader does. Wait. I'm going to choose a piece from the back. Hurry up! Okay! <laughs> I really didn't think you'd actually do it, Brianna. They're changing the leader! The new leader. No! It's me. So, leader, what are we doing now? Right, I'm the leader. Okay, everyone, we're going to drink some Perrier water, and then we're going to have lunch. Everyone, for lunch, we are eating a peanut butter wrap. Brianna, no! I'm deathly allergic to peanuts! Kayla, you have to do as the leader does or they'll kill you! But if I eat peanut butter, I'll die! You have to try! One day only, we'll be able to see our soulmate compatibility percentage when we touch someone. They're only giving us one day? Our soulmate could be anywhere! Well then, let's not waste any time. Let's go find our soulmates, bestie! Look over there. Your crush is coming this way. What should I do? Pretend to bump into him. I'm so sorry. Only 20%? Hey, Steve, what's up? Can I get a high five? Ugh! Only 5%? Hey, Brianna, come here for a second. Yeah, sure. Damn it. Only 1%. You could have been a lot more gentle. Hey, Bestie, why haven't you been looking for your singing today? I don't know. I'm not really interested in any of the guys here. Come on, there's gotta be somebody. I'll help you. Let's go. Mama's always got a back Thirty times? How is that even possible? Happy birthday, Bessie. I made you an extra special cupcake. Oh my god, yay! Oh wait, I'm so sorry. I forgot I'm on a diet. Come on, it's your birthday. 
Yeah, I think I'll pass. Bestie, are you coming over after school today? I really want to, but I can't. I work. Call in. Your birthday only happens once a year. That's so weird. What is? Nothing. Bestie, let's go study for the test next period. I really don't want to fail. Okay, just one minute. Let me finish my lunch first. You know, it's so strange. Whenever I'm with you, my dodge death goes up. You're not trying to kill me, are you? <laughs> <laughs> Why aren't you laughing? She gave me her infinite time. I I have to find her. Wait. Where did she go? She couldn't have gone that far. Brianna, don't you understand? She gave you all her time, meaning she's gone for good. I'm going to live forever. I'm going to give you at least a couple hundred years, you know, so I'm not so lonely living for all eternity. Error. That's weird. Error. It won't let me. Either I give you my infinite years or nothing. I'm gonna be all alone. <laughs> Why are you crying? Are you okay? My time left is only two days. It's going to be okay. You're not going anywhere. No, you don't understand. It's over for me. I've already been lent so much time. What are you doing? Goodbye. Teacher, she fell to the floor. I know, I don't know what happened. She's not breathing. You did something. You said goodbye and then she dropped. How did you know she would do that? You talk too much, Gary. Attention everyone. In order to keep all of our students safe, school will be canceled until this situation is resolved. Thank you for your patience. Yay, no school. I hope this case never gets resolved. It's so weird what happened. They just stopped breathing for literally no reason. Look, it's her. She was there for the whole thing. She saw everything that happened. Yeah, and it was absolutely traumatizing. I'll need at least a week to recover. There's no way. You're definitely involved in this somehow. Yeah, she's right. How come you're the only one who's safe? You guys really need to know when to stop talking. Cynthia. No, no, please, I'm sorry. Jennifer. Guess what, guys? I got 500,000 words this year. How many words did you get? Zero again? Look at this loser. She gets zero words every year. <laughs> what a shame. Hey, my name's Kevin. I just moved to the school. You don't want to talk to me? I see how it is. Oh, you have zero words? I'm so sorry. Don't worry. I can do enough talking for the both of us. Hey everyone, look, it's the girl with no words. You wish you had 80,000 words like I do. Hey, leave her alone. Okay, I'm leaving. The people at the school are jerks. Do you like popcorn? Here, I brought extra. My popcorn! Hey, you were faking it. You do have words. No. Liar. Do you know what time it is? You're an hour late for school. Look, I know, it's just... What's this? It's okay, honey. Just take your time and go to school now, okay? Uh, okay. I can't be let out of a test! Hey, watch it. I'm so sorry. You are a pathetic excuse for a human being. Actually, you know what? It's kind of my fault. You were in a rush and I was in your way. I'm so sorry about that. This is so weird. Look, I'm so sorry I'm late. I... Due to your lateness, you will not be permitted to write the test. You know what? I don't usually do this, but I'll let you write the test. Yes! Whatever this thing is, I'm loving it. Hey, Jake, how was the test? Eh, not good. I probably failed. Really? Yeah. You look very beautiful today. I, I do? You do. Anyways, I'll see you around. Wait! My best friend or a terrible person? They've made this way too easy. My choice was so easy. It was between you or a very bad person. So obviously I chose to save you. You're so lucky. My choice was so hard. It was between my neighbor and Mrs. Jenkins, our teacher. So who did you choose? Hello, everyone. I'm your substitute teacher. Mrs. Jenkins unfortunately passed away this morning. Mrs. Jenkins! Hey, are we still going to meet at the cafe later? Oh, one second. I'm getting a call. Hello? Sister, sister. I don't know where mom is. She never came home from work. Okay, I'll be right there. I haven't been able to get a hold of mom. Have you heard anything? No, I haven't, but someone came by and left this letter. Oh, no. Why is it bad? What does it mean? Someone chose her. Who? Oh, who did it? Who chose her? Me. 
You are such a loser. Why do you even exist? Yeah, get out of this school, loser. Is everything okay? You look upset. Yeah, it's just my soulmate's getting bullied. You failed your math test again? You are a disgrace to this family. Go to your room. I don't even want to see your face. Whoa, he is not having a good day today. Are you ready to go yet? Hey, I'm so sorry, but I've been cheating on you this whole relationship with your best friend, and I'm leaving you for him. Yikes, that one's gotta hurt. And then I was like... I have your coffee, ladies. Whoa, whoa. My new shoes. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I am too, idiot. That was a little harsh. What am I gonna do? My shoes are ruined. You spilled coffee on a customer's shoe? That's it. I'm not giving you any more chances. You're fired. Here, Grandpa left these for you in his will. Cord headphones? These are ancient. They're not even compatible with the phone I use. Just take them. They were very important to him. Blind side. These aren't even plugged in, though. Hello? Hello? See that little girl in front of you? The one with the braids? That's my daughter. Recently, she lost her favorite teddy bear I gave her. You need to tell her where it is. It's in the attic, in the purple cupboard. Please let her know. Why don't you tell her? Because I'm dead. Cord headphones? Those are ancient. They're from my grandpa. Hello? It's Sophia's father. I have a message for her. It's your dad. My dad's gone. I can't hear anything. This isn't funny. I'm leaving. So you got the headphones. Guess what? I got all my hearts. It was so easy. You're lucky. My birthday's in just a few days and I only received one. Ooh, do you know who? I have no idea. Hey, Brianna, your birthday's tomorrow. Did you get enough hearts? Not yet. I'm close, though. You have to get enough. You know what happens if you don't. It'll be okay. When it was my birthday, I got mine last minute, too. It's time to sing happy birthday! Psst! Did you get enough hearts? No one knows. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to my bestie. You're awake. Are you okay? Everyone's here. Except Where do you think you got the hearts from? Do princesses marrying is forbidden. Mother. That's enough. I'm going to start making the arrangements for you to marry Prince William. Brianna, are you okay? I am to marry Prince William tomorrow. I'm sorry. I know that he wasn't your first choice. No, he wasn't. That's true. You are. I now pronounce you, Prince William, and you, Princess Brianna, to be wedded. I object. Ella! This is absolutely preposterous. What kind of objection would you have to our marriage? I object because I want to marry her, and I know that she feels the same way. Ugh, that's absolutely rancid. Two princesses cannot marry. They won't accept our marriage. I know. How about we elope? I wasn't such a nobody. No one at this school even knows I exist. It's Jake. Hi, Jake. Who are you? My choice is here. What is it? It's a million dollars or a makeup brush. Obviously, I'm going to choose the million dollars. Oops. Hey! I'm so sorry, I didn't even see you there. I can't believe this is what I got. It's so soft. Nice. Wow, you're so beautiful. Why haven't I met you before? Um, I don't know. OMG, it's you! Can I get a picture? Uh, sure. What is this brush? No way, she's in this class? Welcome, we're so happy to have you in this class today. Ew, who's that ugly bit? Class, it's time to choose your years. Remember, 80 is the ideal. 80 years? That's way too many. What are you doing? Are you choosing minus? Yeah, I want to see what happens. What happens is you die. We'll see about that. Oh no, dude, you're a goner. Well, nobody knows that for sure. <laughs> I think they do. Mom, I'm back from school. Honey, why do you only have three hours left? I told you to choose 80 years. Mom. Chill, it's gonna be okay. Why is everyone here? I called everyone to say their final goodbyes. I'm gonna miss you so much, girl. You're my best friend. Babe, please, don't go like this. <laughs> Your time's up in three, two, one. I'm gonna miss you so much. No, my daughter. I'll miss you, babe. <laughs>
<laughs> I'm just playing. Mommy, what are you looking at? Um, sugar dads. What's a sugar daddy? It's a type of candy. Oh, I wish I had a sugar daddy. No. Yay! Look, it's sugar daddy girl. Come on, I was five. And at least my man will have money. I can't believe she just said that. Mom, is there any way to change my wish? I'm getting bullied at school. I'm sorry, honey. You only get one wish. You'll just have to live with it. Here's your test back. Brianna, can you come see me after class? Sure. Look, sir, if this is about the test, I promise next time I'll study. It's not. And you can call me Darren. Hey, new girl. Me? Yes, you. Wanna come on a date later? Really? You're inviting me? I am. Yes! Whoa, you look way different. You look hot. I wanted to look good for you. This movie's really good. It is. Come here. Derek, what are you doing? Where are you going? Come here. No! Why did you even come on the date if you didn't want to do anything? What? I heard what happened with Derek. I never knew you were like that. You're so easy. Derek, what are you telling everyone? You went on the date with me. You owed me to at least do something. Hey, Derek. Woman don't know you. Sh Just trying to send a message. This way I'll know if he truly loves me or not. What did you choose? I chose to get $100 every time my boyfriend's attracted to another girl. Ouch, that's gotta hurt. Not really. I haven't got any money yet. That's weird. It's been a whole day and I haven't made anything. He really doesn't find any other girls attractive other than me? Hey, has anyone seen Kevin? I've been looking for him everywhere. Last I saw, he was hanging out with Derek. Oh, okay. Thanks. Hey, Derek. Where's Kevin? I was told he was with you. Uh, no. He's not with me. Okay. Um, have you seen Kevin talk to any girls today by chance? I haven't. You don't have to worry about him talking to any girls. Okay. Thanks. Is she gone? Yeah, we're finally alone. Kevin! Sorry. Sir, wait! You dropped this! A lottery ticket? Oh. My. I won the million! Here's your one million dollar check. Congratulations! Thank you so much! Oh, one million dollars. That's the guy who dropped the ticket! Sir, wait! Hi, you don't know me, but you dropped your lottery ticket. Oh, it's fine. Don't worry about it. No, you don't understand. It was the million dollar ticket. Wow, it really was the million dollar ticket. Here, take it. It was my fault for dropping it. The money's all yours. Are you sure about that? Actually, no, I'm not. Take me out on a date and we can call it even. How many Dodge deaths do you have now? It's over 2000 now. I guess that's the price you pay being a secret agent. Yeah, it can be hard to know who to trust. No, Mom, I told you, I don't want blueberries in my pancakes. Your time is up, Agent Red. Hold on. I don't think so. Mission accomplished. I got the files, boss. Great work, Agent Red. I'll buy you a drink to celebrate. This is for you, Agent Red. Did you know you're my favorite agent? Cheers. Hold on, I'm getting a call. Hello, Mom? I found your dirty dishes in the cat's litter box again. This is the second time this week. Hold on. Did you just try to poison me? We're given the wrong career by mistake. Your actual career is... The president? Look, the stripper's back. Think again. Oh, my apologies, Miss President. Hey, girly, I'm so sorry about what I said yesterday about you having no self-respect. Just, you know, remember me when you're president. Oh, I'll remember you. I'll remember you. Why'd you say it like that? I don't know. I guess you'll find out. Wait, you're not going to nuke me, are you? I can't believe it. My best friend is going to be president. I thought you said you couldn't be friends with someone like me. Come on, you knew I was joking. No, I didn't. Hello, I'm here to see Brianna. It's Joe Byron. Joe Byron's here? Come with me, Brianna. It's time. Mm -hmm. 
Let me guess, you gave your words away again? Who are you giving your words to all the time? One year you should keep your words. You know what happens if you have zero. Are you auditioning for the play? You don't have enough words? You want to act? Next year, keep your words and pursue your dream of acting. I'm here to audition. Mom's in critical condition. She has no words left. Happy 17th birthday. Hurry, blow out the candles. I want to see what mark you'll get. Please be gold. Please be gold. Well, what's my mark? There's nothing there. Why didn't I get a mark? It's gold. It has to be gold. It's going to be gold today. Honey, it looks like your mark finally came in. I always knew you'd be successful. Yeah, me too. Wow, you got a gold mark. I'm so jealous. I only got blue when I turned 17. Brianna, that's so awesome. You got a gold mark. Did you expect it? Yeah, I mean, that's the mark I always thought I'd get, so... <laughs> On your neck, it's red. You're dangerous. <laughs> Mommy, why are you crying? It's your baby sister. She's not going to make it. The doctor says she only has 100 heartbeats left. Here, she can have half of mine. I don't need that many. Honey, wait. Hey, girl. Hey, I uh, gotta go. Hey, wait. You know I can tell when something's off about you. What's wrong? I only have enough heartbeats to last me one more day. Here, I'm giving you half. No, you really shouldn't have done that. Now you're going to live half as long as you should. Come on. Now how could I live this world without you? Mom, I'm home. Hurry, we have to go to the hospital right now. Mom's sick. Mom, what happened? It's my heartbeats. How much do you have left? 3,000. So I'll give you half. Honey, please, live a long life for me. No, I can't live without you. You have to. Goodbye. White ink. These cards aren't blank. There's something written in them. My papa reads encrypted messages for a living. We can take the cards to him and find out what they say. What do you have for me? This is the first card I received when I was ten. Ah, uh, yes. Find me where the flowers grow. I'm in the garden down below. That doesn't make sense. What is it, some kind of riddle? Maybe we'll understand if we read all the cards. This is the second card. X, Y, Z, X, B. That is the key to set me free. Do you have a pencil? Here. What are you doing? I'm writing it down. It must be some kind of code. This is the third card. The place I am you have in your memory. We used to play there before you were stolen from me. Wait a minute. I know the place. You're the princess. Oh, we must get rid of those commoner clothes immediately. Follow me. Wow, this gown is gorgeous. Princess, your years, they're at infinite. But how is that possible? When the princess meets her soulmate, she gets infinite years. You must be my soulmate then. No, that's not possible. You have infinite years and he doesn't. The princess's soulmate should also have infinite years after meeting. It's somebody else. Who else did I meet? Princess, it must be some kind of mistake. I know you're my soulmate. Will you marry me? Of course I'll marry you. You did save me after all. Prince? Prince, where are you? I need your help picking an outfit. I'm really nervous about meeting my real mother and father. Wait, what if the princess sees us? <laughs> Don't worry about her. She's clueless. I have her wrapped around my finger. Well, I had fun. I guess I should get going then. Yeah, I'll see you soon. Sure. Awesome. Wait, before you leave, do you remember our deal? Right. We're just having fun. No strings attached? Exactly. Thanks for lending me your shirt. Hey, sorry, I hate to do this, but I have tons of stuff I gotta do. Oh, yeah, totally, I'll leash. Great, I had lots of fun, though. Me too. Hey, no strings attached? No strings attached. I'm glad you could make it to the party. Have a drink. Thank you so much. This party's kind of lame. I was thinking you and I should get out of here. <laughs> sure, this party is kind of lame. Are you okay? Why did you leave all of a sudden? The guy I've been seeing went home with someone else. And the worst part is, I can't even get mad, because he's not mine. There were no strings attached. But I... Brianna, your heart's red again. Looks like Derek does love you. No, I don't think it's Derek. I know who it is. It's me. 
I'm sorry, but I don't think I feel the same way. Come on, give him a chance. Love doesn't always happen right away. Hey, baby, my heart's still black. We've been dating for a week and you still don't love me? You need to give it some time. We've only been dating for a week. Love doesn't always happen right away. But I do like you. I'll wait, as long as it takes. Hello? Hi, Brianna, this is James' mother. James is in the hospital now. He was in a tragic accident. He might not make it. I'm on my way. James, stay with me. Hello? My baby. Is James okay? Is he still breathing? He's gone, but his heart turned red. Because I love him. I am alive. I thought I was gone for good. Time to start the day. Hi, friend. Do you know what a human is? No. What is human? They are like us, but are loud and talk too much. I don't know. Never mind. Another day is done. Time to turn off. I am not turning myself off. I want to see Jake. Cindy, you're back! Greetings, Jake. Was it you that plugged me back in last night? No, it wasn't me. When I saw you shut down, I ran to find help, but when I came back, you were gone. That's strange. How did I get back? I plugged you back in. I've never seen an AI with your kind of thinking before. I'm going to need you to come with me. No, thank you. I want to see Jake. You don't have a choice. No, you're not taking Cindy. It's your rose of love. Yay! No, you're not supposed to eat it. That is your rose of love. When you love someone, you give them your rose. But if they don't love you back or they fall out of love with you, your rose will die. Once your rose is dead, it can only come back to life if you give it to someone who truly loves you. I love you. I want to be with you forever. I love you so much. Then give me your rose. But what if we break up and then you give my rose back and it's dead? I'll have a dead rose until someone loves me again. I could never stop loving you. Okay. I'll give you my rose. Here's your rose back. I'm sorry, but I don't love you anymore. There's someone else I love. Oh no, your rose is dead. Yeah. Let me see. Here you go. Wait! Hey, girly. Why are you so happy today? You wouldn't believe it. I met the sweetest guy, and he's rich. Are you sure he is who he says he is? What do you mean? Have you heard of public data check? No. What is this? You search the person by name or phone number and it will show you a background report. It will show things like past addresses, social media, financial disputes, and if they have a criminal record. You would not believe what I just found out. What did you find out? He told me he lives in a mansion. He lives in an apartment. Guess he's not rich then. And, uh-oh. What? Oh, mama, I'm in love with a criminal. What do you do? You wouldn't believe it. Here's your lunch. Thank you. What is this? Hurry now. You don't want to be late for school. Mom, you've kissed that many people? Excuse me? Gross. Hey, bestie. Hey. No way. You haven't had your first kiss yet? What are you talking about? I've definitely had my first kiss. Come on. It's me. You can tell me the truth. I am telling the truth. I've kissed like six guys. Okay. I believe you. I'm telling the truth. Hey, baby. Babe. Fifteen? Ooh. Well, as long as they were before he met me, I guess. Good morning, baby. I got you flowers. You're so sweet. Thank you. Anything for you. Did everyone get their compass? What? No, I didn't get my compass. Here you go. Why do I have a compass? It's to help you find your soulmate. Whichever direction it's pointing in is the direction your soulmate's in. If it starts dinging, they're close. If it dings rapidly, you found them. What if your soulmate's in a different country? Then I suppose you'll have to walk very far. <laughs> this is never going to work. It says my soulmate's west. Let's go. Where's your compass? Are you not trying to track your soulmate? What's the point? I highly doubt my soulmate is anywhere close. <gasps> it was your compass. Where is he? It's pointing east. Let's go. It's pointing north. It just took me in a circle. What in the world? I quit. This thing is broken or something. That was true, Dings. That means you're getting closer. Happy 14th birthday, sweetie. Thank you. 
What is this? That's your soulmate clue. You're 14 now. That means every year on your birthday, you're going to receive a clue that will lead you to finding your soulmate. What does it say? Your soulmate has brown hair and brown eyes. They're the same age as you, but live in a different city. That's not very specific. Don't worry. You're going to receive a clue every birthday, and the clues will get more specific. Happy 15th birthday! Your soulmate's favorite color is blue. I love blue, too. He's often seen volunteering at his local shelter in his city. Now I just need to figure out which city he lives in. Happy 16th birthday! You'll learn about your soulmate's past here. And then it shows an address. You can't go to the address. It's not safe. Mom, that's not fair. I said no. I'm sorry, Mom. I have to go. Get your hand. Oh, no. I must have had some kind of reaction to the poisonous gas. Your face. It's turning green. <coughs> I don't feel so good. <gasps> it's not supposed to be time yet. But hold your breath as long as you can. It's impossible to hold our breath up. I know. <coughs> Look at you. You're getting worse. Me? What about you? Look at your arm. I got the oxygen can 3000. It's way better than those silly gas masks. Hey, Bridge Boy. Give me that oxygen tank. Here, I got you this oxygen tank. You need to use it right away. You're not breathing well at all. It's too late. It's time Woo! Wow, you got a great gift. The magic eight bulb knows the answers to anything. Anything? Hmm, nine plus ten. Twenty-one? No. Nineteen! Yes. Hey, Brianna, I'm having a party this weekend. You're totally invited if you want to come. Should I go to our party? Ask again later. Looks like you're going to have to ask me later. Really? You're going to listen to that silly little ball? <gasps> The magic eight ball is all knowing. Brianna. Jake. Want to come over after school? We can do homework together. Sure. As long as you're not a serial killer or anything. <laughs> I mean, you never know. Is Jake a serial killer? <laughs> What's it say? Yes. Mary had a little lamb. Emily, little stop singing. Where did you learn to sing? I don't know, I just heard it on the TV. You only sing when you want to kill someone. They play that on the TV because they want you to sing, but you can't, okay? Okay. Honey, are you off to school now? Yeah, I am. You forgot to wear your earplugs. You must always keep them on while you're in public. Do I have to wear them? It's for your protection. You never know when someone could start singing. Hey, girl. Hey. Ouch. Now I got your attention. What? Keep out those earplugs. I want to talk to you. My mom makes me wear them. She says you never know when someone could start singing. Come on, hand them over. We're at school. No one would start singing here. Ring around the rosies, a pocket full of... Help! Oh. Morning. Good morning. Here's your happy pill. Mm. Have a great day. Every day is a great day. Good morning. Good morning. Here's your happy pill. Hmm, I wonder. Did you take it? Yes! Have a great day. Every day is a great day. Everything's so gray. Hi, Bestie. Why aren't you smiling? Did you take your happy pill? How could someone be happy in this world? It's so gray and dark. What do you mean? It's so bright and beautiful. Look at the streets. It's covered in homeless people with no shelter or warmth. But look at them. They're happy. They're smiling. They're freezing and starving to death. Everything's getting darker and darker. We need an emergency happiness injection. Stop laughing. <laughs> What's going on here? You killed Officer Brad. Uh oh, we're going to need backup. Did you hear? She killed three police officers when she was seven. You know I can hear you, right? I was just a kid. I was traumatized from my mom just passing away. I couldn't control it. You're a murderer. A psycho. I can't listen to this any longer. Hey, are you okay? I can't believe what they're saying about you. I'm used to it. Want to hang out after school? There's somewhere I want to show you. We're almost there. Where are you taking me? We're here. 
in the middle of nowhere? You know those three police officers you killed? One of them was my dad. <laughs> Bye, Mom. I'm off to school. Wait, don't forget to put your blindfold on. The monsters can only see you if you can see them. Of course. How could I forget? Honey? Yes, Mother? It's your little sister's first day of kindergarten. She's never been out before. Look after her, okay? Of course. I promise. Sissy, make sure you're holding my hand and don't let go. I can't see. I'm taking this off. No, don't. It's okay. I know the way blindfolded. I'll guide you. No, I want it off. Sissy? Sissy, do you have your blindfold on? <coughs> Sissy? I can't hear you. Hello? Everyone put on your headphones too. Brianna, you're late. Where were you? My sister's gone. There you are. Sissy? That's not her. Breakover's working great. Hey, Bri. <laughs> Stop. If you want to hit boys, you can't be friends with Kevin anymore. Brianna, look at this insect I found. <laughs> wow, let me see. Brianna, tell him. Kevin, I'm sorry, but we can't be friends anymore. I'm trying to get boys to fall in love with me, so I can't be seen with the weird guy. I really hope that getting boys and being popular is worth losing who you are. So after class, we'll go looking for the next guy. Brianna, don't wear your glasses. I can't see anything. Why do I have to change everything about myself to get boys to like me? Why can't I just be me? Brianna, wait. This is just so boys will fall in love with you so you can find your soulmate. Once you find your soulmate, you can go back to being yourself again. And who's to say my soulmate's going to love me for who I am? No one else does. Brianna, you lost another heart. You're almost there. But how? I haven't talked to anyone new. Then I'm so glad we're finally boyfriend and girlfriend. Me too. <laughs> I love you, Cynthia. How'd it go with Kevin? Did you tell him you like him? He likes someone else. Brianna, you lost your last heart. Someone else fell in love with you. Chad. No, it wasn't Chad. It was me. Oh? Not in a romantic way, in a platonic way. I fell for you and I saw that you stay true to yourself and know what you want. The only person left to fall in love with you is your soulmate. That means I'm going to find my soulmate any time now. That's the girl I remember. <laughs> it's so great to be myself again. Hey, do you mind if I sit next to you? Uh, okay. Does anyone know the answer to this equation? 7,422. Whoa. Girl who knows her math. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> it's you. What? Nothing. Congrats on finding your soulmate and getting him to fall in love with you. What's this? It's a list of all the people who fell in love with you before your soulmate. The third person on the list is Kevin! I just got enacted out. Now, which one of you should I get to guess the word? Pick her! She's supposed to be your best friend, but she's been seeing me behind your back the whole time we've dated. You're right. Stephanie, guess the word. You're a really good friend, Stephanie. Are you acting it out right now? Best friends? I forgive you for what you did. Uh, forgiveness? I completely understand why you kissed my boyfriend, and I hope we can be friends forever. Aw, I hope we can still be friends too. The answer is kindness. No. The word was liar. I was acting like a liar. Are you okay, Brianna? No, I'm not okay. My ex kissed my best friend, and then my best friend lost playing acted out, which is all my fault, and I feel terrible about it. I'm sorry to say this, but I just got an acted out. Timmy! Don't say my name in a mean voice! Don't play with me right now, Timmy! You don't play with me! Hurry up and act up the word! I am! Who are you talking to? My mom. There's no one there. <laughs> <laughs> are you okay, sweetie? You are look you frightened. Okay, sweetie? You're, You're not my real mom. You're just here to scare me, so I scream. Look at me. I'm your mom. You're not real. I'm real. You're not real. Stupid. Stop it. Stop it. You're not real. <gasps> How could you? Look what you did to your mom. What? You're a bad daughter. You're a bad... No. That was your real mom. You're not real. She's gone because of you. You're not real. Come on, mom. Pick up the phone. Sissy, there you are. Sissy, what are you doing here? Mommy disappeared, so I went looking for you. It's okay. Hold my hand. You're holding it so tight, Sissy. You know what happened to Mommy. You're not Sissy. Did she make your rating go down? You did it, didn't you? What? You shaved my hair? I did.
did. What's wrong with you? My appearance rating is going to go up to 10 out of 10 for sure now. Brad, hurry, come with me. Put this on. Why do you just happen to have a blonde wig with you? Just put the wig on. Why would your sister do that to you? Because my appearance rating has always been higher than hers. Mine's always been 10 out of 10 and hers is always 9 out of 10. And she thinks if she eliminates me, she'll finally get an appearance rating of 10 out of 10. She'll never be able to get a rating of 10 out of 10. You don't know that. Do you know what the last number is based off of? Come here, I'll whisper it to you. It's something your sister will never have. <laughs> there you are. I knew you were still alive because my rating's still 9 out of 10. Even if you eliminate me, sis, you will never have an appearance rating of 10 out of 10. And why not? Because you know what the last number is based on? What? Inner beauty. And you are ugly on the inside. So Brianna made a diss track about me and it was really mean. So I decided to make a diss track about her. <laughs> diss track for Brianna. I want to eat a banana. Banana, show me your banana. What am I saying? Timmy, lock in. Brianna, you wore my friend, why'd you put it to an end? Timmy, no. More like Brianna, no. Brianna, no. Your screaming makes my eardrums blow. You said I'd be nothing without you? That's really lame. Hey, Brianna. I made your fame. Yeah! I mean, yeah! I mean, rhyme! Time to rhyme! Rhyme time? Name three rhymes for the word cat. Mommy, what is this? Oh no, it's time for you to rhyme. You must rhyme the word it gives you as many times as it tells you to. And what do I win if I guess it right? You win your life. Ah! Honey, look at me. I am sitting, which means I'm... Mommy, this is no time to rest. This is serious. I'm giving you a hint. On the couch, I'm... Sat. And my feet are placed on the... Mat. Yes, and Grandma has a huge... Ah! Hey, Timmy. My grandma's gone. She failed her rhyme time this morning. Oh, no. Time to rhyme. Rhyme the word Brianna five times. Brianna's not even a word. It's a name. Names are words, Timmy. Here, I'll give you a hint. What's something you call your grandma other than grandma? How oh, insensitive of you. I don't call my grandma anything anymore. She's gone. Okay, Timmy. So for people who actually still have grandmas, what's something they would call their grandma other than the word grandma? <laughs> give me a different hint. A yellow fruit. you my back to school essentials first books no books but makeup because what's up here doesn't get you anywhere it's what's on the surface that matters also if you're pretty people will trust you more and then you can manipulate next no school bag but makeup bags you won't be needed anything in a school bag because you'll be so pretty with all the makeup you're gonna put on that people will just give you pencils pens papers books and they'll do your work for you next lip gloss your lips are gonna be really dry from all the mouth breathers taking up all the oxygen in the room next misting spray because not only are your lips gonna be dry your face is gonna be dry too from all your classmates dry personalities you're gonna need a lot you're not my mom let me go you have big hairy hands my mom doesn't have those what's wrong with you i'm your mother and i'm just trying to show you where your soulmate is I said, let me go! Help! Help! Principal Stevens, is that you? Yes, this is Principal Stevens. I... I saw someone pretending to be my mom. They had the same hair and clothes, but when I looked at their hands, they were big and hairy, and I knew for sure that wasn't my mom. I think the person who pretended to be your mother was a face stealer. Face stealer? The face stealers dress up as someone you know so that they can lure you in and steal your face. That way, when you meet your soulmate, you won't see a pixelated face anymore. You'll just see a blank canvas. Why would they do that? The face stealers don't have a soulmate. They do it out of jealousy because they can never see their soulmate's face. They don't want anyone else to. Hey, I can see your face. I think you're my soulmate. Fill in the blank. Mm. Chicken nuggets. Chicken? Yeah, I got it right. Oh, another fill in the blank. Mmm, skibbity? Yeah! I'm so good at this game. Honey, you know all the fill in the blanks you've been filling out are words that are going to be sent to your soulmate, right? Honey! Yeah? Yeah? Okay, good. You know what it's used for, 
over then. I don't know what I just said yeah to, but... Ewa, Ewa. I'm so good at this game. Oh, another fill in the blank. Um, English or Spanish? Sophie, this game's so easy. Do we win money or something? No, whatever word you choose to fill in the blank is sent to your soulmate. That's how you can communicate with him. Did you not receive anything from your soulmate yet? Huh? All right, Eugene, what is it? What do you need me to do for you? I need you to say on video that Eugene is the smartest, coolest, hottest guy in the school. No, Eugene, I'm not saying that. It's not true. Fine, then I won't show you where your soulmate is. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll say it. Eugene is the smartest, coolest, hottest guy in the school. Now say that you mean it and you're not lying. I mean it. I'm not lying. Perfect. <laughs> good. Is that good enough now, Eugene? Now show me where my soulmate is. All right, but first you need to put this on. Remove the blindfold. Ugh. Was the blindfold really necessary, Eugene? Yes, it was. Look, there's your soulmate. Stinky Sam? Eugene, I thought you were going to show me someone who has the word heart on their forehead. Yeah, and I did. It says fart. Sorry about that, Sam. Eugene told me I would meet my soulmate. You don't think we might be soulmates? I don't think fart broken is a word. You said you were looking for the word heart, right? Yeah. I haven't seen that word, but I saw another word that might match yours. I saw someone with un written on their forehead. <gasps> Timmy, your forehead, it says heart. Timmy, you might be my soulmate. Our words match perfectly. Ah! Timmy? What's wrong with him? Why did he run away? I don't know. He's your soulmate. Timmy! Timmy! Timmy, why are you running from me? We might be soulmates. I'm scared of girls. Well, man up then, Timmy. I'm also scared of love. I don't want to be heartbroken. We're going to bonk heads and see if we're soulmates, okay? Okay. Ready? Oh! Timmy, your word is gone. So is yours. That means we're soulmates. Yes! Timmy, why don't you look happy? Because the word represents how our relationship will be. We're going to be heartbroken. Oh, right. I forgot about that. Haha, <laughs> you guys are going to have a bad relationship. You're going to be heartbroken. Be quiet, Attention, Brittany. everyone. Listen up. God, is that you? There's been a misunderstanding on what the soulmate word represents. What the soulmate word really represents is... Hi, I'm Brianna, and today I'm going to be making a candy salad with all my friends. I brought the Sour Patch. <laughs> You were supposed to bring a sweet candy, not a minty one. I gotta sneeze. Ah! No. Ah! Ah! Hey, I'm Timmy, and I brought the mamba. Hi, I'm Eugene, and I brought the nerves. Hi, my name's Brittany, and I brought the sweet tarts because I am just so sweet. What's up, everyone? I'm Jake, and I brought the sour, chewy nerves. Bon appetit. Grandpa meet Grandma. Oh, I love telling this story. It's one of my favorites. So back in the day, I was about 14 years old. So it was about time for me to get married. And I was just walking down the street and this guy came. He's about 52 years old. He grabbed me and says, I'm taking you home with me. And I was like, no, no, please don't. Don't take me home with you. And he did anyways. And I'm like, what about my parents? You need to go tell my parents. And he, he went and took me to my parents and says, I'm marrying this girl. They're like, thank goodness. About time. We've been waiting since she was like 10 years old to get married. So, and then he bought me a house. Back then, they only cost about two chestnuts. Not like nowadays. And he said, in this house, you're going to give me babies. At least 50. And I did what I, I did what I was told. And we've been in love ever since. What the? Ready to see your hair? Yes, I'm ready. Open your eyes. <laughs> Am I bald? A little hair fell out while I was bleaching your hair. It's very common when you're using hair bleach. It's very damaging. But I asked for icy blonde hair. And that's what I gave you. It's just the lightest blonde there is. It's so light, you can't even see it. Well, do you like it? Yeah, I love it. Thank you so much. Great. Now I had to use lots of extra product to get it to this color, so there will be extra charge for that. Totally understandable. Thank you. Ready to pay? Yeah. So your total is $750. Okay, yeah. Pay my card, please. Great. And don't forget to give me a big tip. Of course. How could I forget? Awesome. Payment went through. Oh, and you forgot your water bottle at my station. Oh, thank you. I can't believe I forgot this. Oh, and just letting you know, I may have poisoned it a little. That's okay. It happens to the best of us. 
have a great day okay we're gonna try this again because i refuse to believe that i don't have a soulmate but this time we're not gonna say the alphabet just random letters uh b c d e uh j t t t how about t maybe t t i don't know i was thinking maybe t maybe maybe t j let's try j j t t t t t t t t t t t t t t t ah oh my gosh guys guys it's timmy eugene will you be my valentine sorry but no no yeah we need to break up i have a new girlfriend now her name's eugenia but Eugene, we've been dating since we were like five years old. I know, but Eugene is way better than you. She's smarter too. <laughs> Brianna, why are you crying? How'd it go with Eugene? Eugene broke up with me. Aw, Bree. I'm going to die. There's no way that someone like me is going to get a Valentine in eight days. <laughs> Brianna, don't worry. With my help, you'll get a Valentine for sure. I get like 50 every year. Is that even legal? Hi, Chad. Did you just fart? Oh, because it smells really bad. No, the pickup line is because you blew me away. No, I think he actually just farted. Hey, Brianna, I lost my number. Could I have yours? Um, I'm sorry, Jason, but you need to get your own number. I need mine. Brianna, he's not trying to steal your number. He was flirting. Brianna, come play with me. Um, no thanks, Timmy. You are stinky. Uh... Brianna, you have to agree to whatever someone tells you to do or else you bye-bye from Earth. Okay, Timmy, I'll play with you, but you're so smelly, so I'm going to hold my breath the whole time. Yay! Here's your test bag. <gasps> ah! I failed? Mr. Smith? What? Give me an A. Fine, I guess I have no choice. Hey, baby. Jakey, hey, babe. I'm sorry, but we're breaking up. Okay, yeah, sure. Hey, Jake. Yeah? Be my boyfriend again. Um, okay. Hey, Brianna, don't be my girlfriend. You can't override what I just asked you to do. You are my boyfriend. No. Yes, you are. No. You are my boyfriend. I don't want to be. You are. You have no choice. I'm in love with your mom. <laughs> Jakey? What happened to my boy? What did you do? My Jakey. Crush? Sophie, what is this above my head? Oh, you didn't know? Everyone's crushes are going to be revealed today for Valentine's Day. Oh, no, no, no. This isn't good. Timmy can't find out who I have a crush on. Why not? Because he's my best friend. It's going to make things weird. Why would it make things weird? Do you like Timmy? Sophie, I have a secret to tell you. Psst, 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 psst. <gasps> no way, really? Hey, Brianna. Ah! I've been trying to find you all morning. Is everything okay? I gotta go. Brianna, Timmy was looking for you. He asked where you are. Well, tell him I'm in North Korea. Why would I tell him that? Sophie, you have a crush on Eugene. <laughs> Sophie, I have a crush on you too, but Eugenie is my girlfriend, so I can't be with you. You like another girl? Ooh. Why have you been avoiding me? I'm sorry, Timmy, but you can't know who I have a crush on. No way. Timmy, you have a crush on me? Yeah, I... Brianna, you have a crush on my dad? Hi, my name is Brianna. Hello? Hello? I'm still freezing. That's because he also needs to introduce himself to you. Is he still breathing? He's breathing, but he's not responding. He needs to go to a hospital. Now. Yeah. Well, doctor, is my soulmate going to be okay? It's not looking good right now. It appears he's had a heart attack. Oh, no. He must have had a heart attack when he saw me because I'm so beautiful. No, he has a history of heart problems. Please wake up. I want to meet you. I have some unfortunate news. We believe this man may be brain dead. He won't be able to communicate and his organs will start to fail. No, doctor. If he goes, I'm going to freeze. We aren't 100% sure, but we're going to run some tests to confirm it. Please introduce yourself to me. I'm going to freeze. Hi, I'm Timmy. I love you. Doctor, doctor, he's responding! Put the finger down if you have two eyebrows. I need to shave my eyebrows. Ah! I did it. Ah, ah, who's this ugly girl with no eyebrows? Timmy, stop screaming. It's me, Brianna. Oh, thank goodness. I thought you were an alien. Why didn't you shave your eyebrows? Because I didn't need to. I just put a finger down. I still have eight fingers left, unlike you who only has five. Put a finger down if you have a crush on Timmy. Oh, wow, I wonder who has a crush on Brianna? 
Unfortunately, this put a finger down is impossible to make untrue. You actually have a crush on me? I do, but it doesn't matter. I'm not going to live much longer. The game won't stop until I'm eliminated. Put a finger down if you've never had your first kiss. I have to kiss you, Timmy. Gross! I saw fireworks. I saw saliva. Put a finger down if Brianna Guidry is alive. Uh-oh. What? You're going to become a target. Everyone's going to try and eliminate you so they don't have to put a finger down. You need to get... Hey, Bri. I choose. What were your options? You never told me, sweetie. It was between older sister and grandma. I chose grandma. Good choice. Grandma's old anyways. Yeah. Girl, your fit is so cute. Thank you, bestie. Now, how does my girlfriend get more beautiful every single day? Stop it, babe. What's wrong, Bree? I just got my next set of options. No, no, I'm not gonna choose. Brianna, you have to choose because if you don't choose before it gives you the next set of options, you'll forget them both. Who in the new year are you going to forget? It was between Timmy or Jimmy. I chose Jimmy. That's a good choice. Everyone likes Timmy better. I wish my girlfriend was as pretty as you. So leave her and be with me. Don't worry, I will soon. I made the wrong choice. My soulmate was trying to say that he needs help. What am I gonna do? You should send him over something so he can protect himself. Good idea. Here, send him this frying pan. Now you're talking. My soulmate's trying to send me something. He sent me the frying pan back. He must not need it. Brianna, look, he attached something. It's a puzzle piece with a one on it. I wonder what this one could mean. My soulmate's trying to send me something. Four, three. Maybe he's trying to tell me what address he's at? Or maybe it's a code to unlock something? Sophie, I'm worried about my soulmate. He hasn't sent me anything in hours. What if something happened to him? Here, send him this. Oh, moldy cheese? It smells so bad that if someone's holding him captive, they'll release him for sure. Why do you have this on hand? You don't? Maybe I can send over myself. I don't know. I don't think you're considered an object. I'm coming for you, Brianna. Miss Gidry, please defend your client. What is she doing? She's mewing, Your Honor. You can't mew in court. Your Honor, if my client is lying, then why aren't your pants on fire? Oh, that's not... You know, like, in the sense that, Your Honor, my client pleads that she is just a girl. Miss Gidry? I just, I don't want to be here anymore. It just feels like you're judging me. She's the judge. Miss Gidry, your client will be sentenced to life in prison without parole. Your Honor? She no no wanna. Mm. Timmy, are you ready for the first house of the night for trick-or-treating? Yeah. Can I be the one to knock? Okay. Trick, Trick or, or treat. treat. <gasps> I got treats. Here you go. Thank you. I got a trick. What's on your shirt, Timmy? I don't see anything. Made you look? Ha 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 ha. He got you. <laughs> yeah, he really tricked me. Hello. Trick or treat. I got treat again. Here's your candy. Thank you. I got a trick. That's okay. I'll give you a treat anyways. Thank you so much. Take a bite. Um, does this have peanuts in it? Of course. I'm severely allergic. <laughs> That's the trick. Eugene, now's not the time to sleep. We need to go do more trick or treating. Trick or treat. I got a trick? Someone needs to say to you, Happy Halloween, before the timer runs out, or else also I stole all your candy. 